Hello, everybody. Welcome back to LSPDFR. Once again, doing another Sheriff Patrol here in the beautiful Caprice with the same uh, pack we were using last time. It's a good looking car, I must say. I know today is a crazy day since it is election day. I hope you guys are all being safe uh, and having a good evening at home tonight. And uh, you're, uh, you're staying sane as well. But we're going to get out on patrol and see what we can get into. Uh, we got a medical escort required. Okay, we'll take it. Oh, okay, it's going to be behind us. Let's go ahead and just light up and turn around here real fast. And we'll make a left on a dirt road since there is a ambulance up here that needs our assistance. Actually, I don't know why it's on a dirt road, but uh, that seems to be the case from what I can tell. Let's go ahead and go with the uh, secondary light setup. There we go. Oh, we have the TA going. It's a great looking package on this car. I do like it a lot. And even, you know, I'm not a fan of uh, wraparound Ram bars, but I like the one on this. So I decided to keep it. I did upgrade the engine to EMS level four because these cars seem to be a little slow uh, in this pack uh, compared to everybody else. Okay, here we go. What do we got going on here? Uh, what seems to be the issue? Affirmative, listening on EMS channel. Officer on scene, we're headed to Mount Zona Medical Center. Guide us in. Uh, you can press T to toggle driving state of the ambulance. They're just gonna Austin Powers it right now, so okay. And they're gonna cell phone it as well. Come on, follow me this way. I think we're supposed to escort them uh, by shutting the roads down and stuff. Uh, yep, they figured it out, sweet. So we'll do exactly that. We're gonna go code three lighting. Uh, that way we can shut the road down. They're making a right turn here. We're losing sight of you. Slow down. Well, okay. Oh, we just want to make sure that the road is closed off for you here. And that's exactly what we're doing. Like this uh, Prius coming around the corner. There you go. You're good. Oh, <laughs> no. Don't think that's how you drive an ambulance. Are you supposed to? Uh, they follow us. That's probably what it is, isn't it? Yeah, that seems to be the logic here. They, they follow where we go. So you can't really shut the roads down, sadly. So we'll just keep an eye on that. There we go. This is a little bit better. Go around this way. Between these cars. Will you do that? I don't know if their logic does that. No, nope, they want to get in a car accident instead. All right. Well, we tried. You can't say we didn't try here. This is gonna be a long trip, I have a feeling. I've been getting asked a lot of questions recently about OCRP, where is it at? How come I haven't put a video out on it? And it really hasn't been that long since I haven't put a video out on it. Um, but uh, we are revamping the servers. We're uh, making them a one sync server, so that's more players that can be involved in it. Uh, and then on top of that, we are just, uh, we're, we're kind of removing our economy and the way that uh, the grind was, uh, you know, kind of plaguing the RP style. And we are going to be going to a V-Menu Trainer system. Uh, so we can have uh, RP kind of happen a little quicker uh, than it has in the past, which I'm very excited for that. So I will be jumping back in there and playing um, in the server again. And eventually, I'll, I'm sure I'll make content on it and, uh, and, and put it out here on the main channel. But uh, it's not a priority right now. Uh, right now, the biggest priority is to get uh, our house off you know, finished up and, and get closed. All right. This is going to be a little harder, I think. All right. Yeah, they are going ham right now with traffic. This is a lot of fun. A lot more fun than I thought it was going to be. Come on, dude. You just took a car out and you're hitting me too. Okay, we're racing now. All right. Well, there you go. All right. We're almost to the uh, hospital. Thank God. My God, man. This has been insane. Absolutely insane so far. Come on. Keep on coming. Keep on coming. You good? Don't hit that. Okay. Yeah, they're good. We're almost there. My lord, man. But yeah, I mean, it was a fun call out. I don't think I've done this one. Uh, in a very, you're going to hit her, aren't you? Yeah, she's going to get taken out. I have a feeling. Are you following me? Or are you going to go in where you're supposed to go? That's the true. They did. Thanks for the escort. Don't mention it. All right. Well, we're going to head back up into the county. And uh, just kind of pretend that never happened. And uh, all is well. Whoa, 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 whoa. My lord, dude. Blew that stop sign, didn't you? Yeah, just a little bit. Just a tad. Uh, I was about to say, it's been pretty quiet so far. Everybody's been doing what they should be doing. But we're going to stop this guy uh, for running that stop. And we'll have a conversation with him about it. If they pull over, 
which they are, just very slowly. Okay, that's where you want to go? No. How about we go a little bit further to the right? Just a little further to the right. Uh, yeah. Unable to detect the pulled over vehicle. Really? Come on. You got it. There you go. There you go. Uh, a little bit further. A little bit further. A little bit further. You almost got it. You almost got it. Okay, that'll work. We'll just roll with that. That works for me. But yeah, this guy just ran that uh, stop sign like nobody's business. So we're going to make contact with him and see what's going on with it. Uh, we'll run the vehicle's information. It is a BF Injection 63 XBS 471. Target vehicle license plate. 63 uh, standing XBS warrant. Uh -oh. 471. A warrant issued. Yep, we'll Approach get a... Uh, caution. We'll get a backup uh, unit Assistance on the traffic stop here since they have a warrant. Grape seed. We'll be smart about it. Looks like it's Occupy one time, so... I mean, we can handle them, but, you know. Charlie 4, roger that. We'll look for those maggots. We'll wait for them to uh, get on scene here. I'm going to go ahead and make contact on the right side of the vehicle and uh, see what's going on here with everybody uh, oh, all over the stop sign. That's what we're stopping them for. Hey, what's going on, man? How you doing? And they're taking off from us. Get back in your car. Go, 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 go. Go. They are taking off, dude. They are taking off. And uh, we know why they're taking off because they have a warrant. And that's why we got our backup. But uh, I don't think they're going to be helping out anytime soon. I get asked what uh, graphics mod I use. I use uh, NVE. And uh, at certain times of the day, it just the, the lights don't look very, very good. So we might be getting to that point of the day where that is the case. All right. He is definitely... Whoa! Out of the way. He's definitely flying down the road, making a left-hand turn. On Union, we'll be taking this back up to uh, the 13, it looks like. Okay. Well, we're the only unit with them right now. And uh, we are not intimidating them in the slightest. So I don't know what they're doing. They're pumping the brake. They're running out of gas or something here. What's going on? I don't know what they're doing. I've seen a lot of vehicles doing this lately uh, in pursuits. They just get in these weird little funky slow moments. Yep. We're heading east on Union Road. That is correct. And uh, we're the only unit with them right now. So we're just going to kind of... RP it to where we don't have any uh, help out here yet since we're so far out in the country. Okay, now they're starting to speed up a little bit more, but not really. Not really. We'll get a, uh, another unit involved in the pursuit. It might be a park ranger vehicle because I have not changed that out yet. It just might be. Every time we're out here, they don't give us a sheriff unit. They give us those. Hey, they gave us a sheriff unit today. Look at that. There he is. Uh, and I think this is going to be it right here. That was a nice box. All right, let's see those hands, dude. Watch our crossfire. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's running. He's running. No, whoa. Just got tased, bro. I got you covered if you want to go in for the arrest on him. I do have you covered. Yeah, these pursuits, they just don't, they don't last very long, and they're not, like, exciting very, very long either. I don't know what, what happened with that. It's the Iron Hotel for you, buddy. All right, we're going to go ahead and stop the traffic in the area since we have a end of a pursuit happening here. And we're going to search the vehicle. We'll get them searched as well in a second. Uh, they're just going to hang out with them for there. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, search the vehicle, see if there's anything illegal in it other than the whole thing with the uh, warrant going on. Uh, 13 loose rounds of 5.56 millimeter ammunition, several containers of black powder, a 20 milliliter bottle, a uh, clear liquid that could be LSD. Um, we know that after, you know, doing it as much as we have, uh, that we might be dealing with some LSD here. So let's see if that is the case. There we go. By the way, Stop the Pet had an update, so you have to update it. Otherwise, you can't get it to work at all. Uh, yep. Field test for the narcotics. I think it's LSD. What do you think? What are you thinking? Uh, yep. I think the old Ehrlich. Reagent test is going to show us that's the case. Uh, no, it's not. Negative. Okay. Well, it could be fentanyl then. Let's see if that's the uh, case. I'm kind of blown away. It's fentanyl. There you go. So now he's got a charge uh, for possession of fentanyl. Let's see what the black powder was. I'm just kind of curious what it could be. Uh, it's a black powder. I don't think it's marijuana, but uh, you never know. Uh, nope. Cocaine, powder crystal? Nah, I don't think so. Uh, negative. Oh, it was positive for marijuana. I'm a dumbass. I wasn't paying attention to that. Um, that's the perk of 
gaming on a 32 inch monitor sometimes you got to look way over to the side um so there you go it was marijuana so we don't care about the marijuana we'll just uh confiscate that get rid of it uh this guy here go ahead and pat him down i got you covered get our our old flashlight out here while he is patting him down we'll help our officer out with that look at the uh backup we got going on here since the uh the highway shut down scott garcia picture of the ped with the known as tecas uh aztecas members a photo of this ped partying a tequila la a hunting license in the name of the ped and a veteran's id card all right mr garcia so you're going to jail for uh your warrant uh we're, we're actually we're gonna double check that real fast here and uh, see if uh, that's gonna be clear. Mr. Garcia, arrest warrant for possession of ketamine. That's what it is. Okay, so arrest records. He's had some issues in the past, quite a few actually. Fleeing or attempting to elude the LEO. There you go. Well, from what I uh, looked up, it looks like ketamine is a schedule three narcotic. So that's what his warrant uh, is uh, for actually. But uh, we don't care about the marijuana, but we do care about the fentanyl. All right, fentanyl's the uh, schedule two narcotic. We got that. Uh, and I think everything else is pretty wrapped up. We're not going to get him for the reckless driving or anything like that. Those are the three charges he's looking at uh, as of now. Submit those charges. There we go. So now he has those three charges being thrown on him as of now. Uh, he's not on probation or parole or anything like that. He has no gun permit. Uh, all is well there, I believe. For the most part, we're going to go ahead and get him uh, taken out of here. Man, hit and escape always does that. Uh, get him out of here in a prisoner transport, and we can wrap this whole show up. There it is. Ain't worth the steam off my piss. Gotta love it. Well, all right. Pulled him over for running the stop sign. That's the least of his worries. We're not worried about charging him with that or giving him a citation for it. I was just going to talk to him about it. The biggest problem he has right now is running from the police over his warrant and then having some fentanyl on him as well. So that didn't work out. We're going to get this thing towed out of here and then the road will be open as soon as they roll out of here, of course. Let's go ahead and get tow service for you and a flatbed truck for you. Awesome. Yeah, the lights look great at night like this. I do like it a lot. So yeah, that's what I use. NVE and then uh, I use uh, the supplied... Uh, visual settings for the bright lights. All right, tow truck picked up the car. There you go. We have this lane blocked right now, but we're going to go ahead and open it up and uh, they're going to be good to go. We'll be back 10-8. Okay, this car here in front of us did some really jank driving there. Uh, they like made a sharp left turn and then back to the right. Man, kind of deja vu here. Uh, this is where we pulled over that uh, one vehicle and then they uh, ended up trying to shoot at us on a DUI charge. So that wasn't nice. But we're going to stop this habanero and see what's going on with it. Uh, They're making a left, which is perfect. This is actually a great spot for a traffic stop up here after the sign. So we'll pull them over as soon as that is convenient for us, which is going to be right here. Yep. Throw your hands in the air. I mean, I don't know what's going on with these guys, but they were driving pretty erratic. And I wasn't a big fan of, of that. All right, I got the uh, spotlight on them here. We'll see what's going on. This is uh, this will work. We'll go ahead and make uh, contact with them as soon as we run the plate. Let's see what we got going on here. Habanero 83NKK324. Target vehicle license plate. Suspended license, possibly. Nora King King 324. A traffic okay. felony. Traffic Approach felony. Caution. We'll get a uh, backup Assistance unit required and to help us out here. Uh, let's go ahead and just get our, get our flashlight out. It's occupied two times. That's why we're getting a uh, backup unit at night like this. We and we just had an officer shot at the other day so we're gonna be taking it a little easier uh with all of that what's going on folks how you doing my name is deputy fabiano with the blaine county sheriff's office reason for the stop tonight uh erratic driving there before you made the right hand turn on union you were just kind of all over the road uh so that's the reason for the stop with all of that you have your uh, driver's license proof of insurance with the vehicle on you front passenger seems to be nervous and sweating hey. okay so we got uh Thanks. devin overstreet and uh, he does own the vehicle and it is valid it looks like as far as all that goes cool well we're gonna see what's going on with all that stuff we're gonna go ahead and uh, see if uh, the passenger has identification as well he's kind of Kiflo. nervous make sure he doesn't have a warrant all right mr saunders appreciate your cooperation with that uh y'all just sit tight here and then i'll be right back okay um we're gonna ask them a question though you haven't been drinking nothing like that tonight right 
Alcohol is not good for my breath. All right, cool. All right, well, we'll be right back. All right, Devin Overstreet is the driver. He does have a suspended license, and that is an arrestable offense, so that's not good for him. He could be in trouble for that. Uh, he's got priors of nothing there. Um, citation records, overtaking, passing on shoulder. I can see that. Littering for vehicle and loitering. Uh, those are the options that uh, were there. Uh, Jason Saunders, uh, parking in tunnel, crossing over center. He's all good to go. We weren't worried about him anyway. I didn't think it was going to be a problem. So we're going to get him out. Uh, we're going to talk to him about the uh, whole issue with the suspended license. And uh, we'll try to work something out with him. If not, we'll uh, try to do something uh, a little bit different. We'll see if he's okay to drive because he is kind of all over the place uh, as far as that goes. All right, driver, I need you to step out of the vehicle for me real fast. If you don't mind. Awesome. Appreciate it. Uh, do me a favor and just come over this way. I'm going to actually have to walk in front of him here. There we go. And uh, we'll talk to him. Wait a go. sec, buddy. Wait a sec, buddy. Stop the pin. All right. Just come on over here. Just follow me this way, okay? And my partner's going to hang out and, and, and make sure everything's okay. Hey, do you know what's going on with your uh, your license? Come over this way, bud. Over this way. I don't want you getting hit by a car and you're just kind of standing out there. There we go. That's much better. Much better. Stop following there. All right. So what's going on with your license? Uh, let's see if that's an option. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I've been drinking. Do I? Vehicle questions. There we go. Uh, did you know your registration expired? Nope. That's not it. Insurance? Nope. Nothing to do with that. Um... You live in this neighborhood? Yes, sir. I live with my grandma. Okay. Uh, where are you where are you headed to? I'm on your way. I'm on my way home. All right. Uh, no drugs, nothing like that tonight, right? Drugs make you sick. All right, cool. Um. All right. Well, that works out for me. I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna work with him on this one. Um. Let's see here. Let's do a uh da, 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 breathalyzer i just want to see make sure he's not drinking because he was kind of all over the road uh when we saw that and if all that's nice. good to go we're gonna now impound his vehicle okay so he's telling the truth with that the problem is the suspended license isn't going to work out so um he will sadly be uh arrested for uh now. the suspended driving on a suspended license as long as he has but the, the priors like that i don't know man I don't know. So we're going to go ahead and uh, do that. And we're going to let this driver, uh, we're going to let the passenger take the car home. I have no problems with the car. I just have the problem with the uh, the driver uh, doing what he did. All right. Hold on. At least him here. All right, man. You have anything illegal on you? It's going to poke me, stick me, harm me in any way. We'll make sure that uh, he doesn't have anything else he's barking up as far as charges go. And uh, Liberty City plane ticket for tomorrow. Membership card. Head pockets filled with loose jewelry and a 12 round 9 millimeter magazine. Okay, well. All right, let's go ahead and grab him. And then we'll put him in the back of our vehicle here. And oop, and then we will. Uh, we're going to search that vehicle once we get the passenger out and talk to the passenger. Make sure everything else checks out with the car. And uh, if it does, then we're going to let him drive it away. That's just how it's going to go. We're doing what we, what we got to do here. But uh, all right, buddy. Uh, do me a favor. Step out of the vehicle. Hold on a sec. All right, excellent. Do me a favor and just uh, st uh, step over on uh, this way for me. Actually, here, I'll just uh, help him over and out of the way. Let's come over here. There you go. Right here is perfect. All right. You have nothing illegal in that car, right? All right. Your buddy uh, is driving on a suspended license, so that's not a good uh, not a good thing. Uh, broken laptop, dirty port of LS, high-vis vest. Nothing of interest. Okay, cool. Well, I'm a man of my word. Uh, we're not going to, you know, pat him down, nothing like that, and... And, and ruin his night we're just gonna go ahead and tell him hey you know what you can um you can uh go to the driver's seat and you can drive it away okay but your buddy crap. is You're going to jail for shit. driving a suspended license thank you so much for the help appreciate that man and uh we're gonna get a uh we'll have this guy transport him so we can get back out there on patrol that's what we're gonna do open up the door all right man you're gonna be uh arrested on the charge of uh driving on a suspended license that's it. Uh, everything else, uh, we're letting your buddy take the car home and all that stuff, so it all works out for you, okay? But you you gotta be uh, you gotta be doing that. You can't be uh, you can't be stupid acting. Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! All right, let's get his uh, paperwork taken care of here. Uh, Mr. Devin Overstreet. 
and he will have an arrest report for driving on a suspended license. Submit those charges. There you go. He's got driving a suspended with knowledge. Knowledge. And that will be that. So uh, we'll go park up and we should hear about the court case of the last one. And we'll find out what happened to Devin as well. But uh, right now we're going to be uh, all done here. We'll be back 10-8. All right, Scott Garcia. We're going to go ahead and reveal the outcomes of those three charges. He was found not guilty for fleeing or attempt to elude Elio, even though he did. Uh, possessed with intent to distribute schedule uh, to narcotic, fine 9,000, five years in prison. Uh, and then uh, the schedule three narcotic was not guilty. So, okay. So the ketamine was thrown out in court, but uh, not the fentanyl. That uh, got him time in the slammer for sure. And Devin Overstreet, who we just pulled over with uh, driving on a suspended license, was fined $469 and he got his license suspended for six months. Granted probation. Officers reporting a pursuit in progress in this area. Okay, I was just getting ready to get back out on patrol, but we'll take that. Uh, yep, you can show us in route. Looks like there's a vehicle over there running from... I don't know what it is about this grapeseed area, man, but uh, they go crazy around here running from the police. And it looks like they're headed towards downtown. In fact, what we're going to do is get a air support unit over here. Uh, since it's about daylight, uh, we want helicopter assistance. I think he's going to be making a left on Jode. He's going to be passing right in front of us on Jode Lane. There he is right there. And they're making a right-hand turn going off-road on this one. It is a Blista Compact, it looks like. I'm going to try to run the vehicle if I can. It is 45 JTN125. Coming back out on the main street. Four, five, John, Tom, and the air Noah, unit is with them, so we can kind of slow off a little bit here. Target is 10 4. Target is 10 All right. Brian Nichols is the RO. As far as we know, we don't know who's driving it, but we assume that that uh, could be the case. Could be stolen. You never know. All right. He is really, really going ham right now on the road. He's about to crash that damn thing. Or I am. <laughs> I had to get in the brakes hard there around that corner. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're good. Oh, he just lost control around that corner. All right. The vehicle is now making a right-hand turn. We're going to be back on O'Neill Way. And uh, we're going to go ahead and ask them if we can pit the vehicle. And see if uh, that's allowed because there's nobody around here right now. We are cleared to pit. All right, cool. We have our backup unit back there. Uh, he'll be ready to pounce on him here, but we're going to try to pit the vehicle here coming up. All right, let's do it here. We're going to do it. We're going to do it now. Not into a car. Not into a car. That was not a good situation there. I'll wait for a little bit better opportunity here. Ooh, missed there. He hit the brakes and then sped up. Is he going to do the U-turn? Nope, not doing the U-turn today. Almost at the back end of that van. Well, I got to say, I'm glad to see that this guy is actually... Whoa, all over the place. All right, that could be it right there. Oh, he's ramming my vehicle hardcore. Hardcore, going the other way. He's giving up, he's giving up. He, he knows he's done. Let's see those hands, dude, in the air, in the air, in the air. Out of the vehicle. Watch the cross, watch the cross. I'm trying to get out of your crossfire. All right, stay right there. Dude, do not bring that van forward at all. Wait. Get a move on. Stop traffic so we don't die here. All right, dude. Moving in on the arrest. We got him in custody. For the most part. You were going down. You were going down. Yeah, he just lost Clear control and then the pretty much put it into that pole, so that worked out for us there. Let me go ahead and shut my siren off here. And I know you can use the little button to turn off your siren from that, but I like it to be a little bit more realistic. Alright. Just sit tight right there, man. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, search the vehicle. Looks like our backup units aren't going to help us at all during this prop, you know, part of it. Uh, an RPG. There it is. Well, receipt for hands on car wash located in Strawberry uh, Get Away brochure. A Righteous Slaughter 7 video game. And an RPG. You don't have any RPGs on you, do you, man? Grenades? Knives? Weapons? Guns? Nothing like that? Let's find out what we got going on here. But the RPG is a definite problem. I could tell you that right now. An iFruit uh, 9iX smartphone, a picture of a pet with the known Korean gangsters. Okay. We know, dude, you're upset. You can't get where you gotta go. Just wait. Mr. Nichols. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get him out of the way here. 
And then we can uh, continue our investigation with the car to the side. All right. The RPG. We have a problem with that, man. We have a problem with that. Let's get this thing towed out of here into evidence. And uh, we will get this road opened back up here shortly. And everybody will be happy once that happens. I'm just going to go pull forward straight into that uh, parking lot. That works out for me. Here we go. And uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, put him in the back of our car. So he was fleeing an LEO and uh, eluding us, of course. Go ahead and grab you, buddy. And we'll put you into our vehicle. Come on over this way. There we go. I know you're rubbing your engine over there. We'll get you in just a second. We'll get you in just a second. In the back of the car he goes. And we're going to find out what's going on with him as far as his record goes and then get his charges going on top of that. All right, Mr. Nichols, uh, he is clear on an arrest report, but he's had citations for fishing, restricted area, uh, graffiti, and blocking right of way. But his arrest report is going to be uh, for felony traffic, fleeing, or attempting to elude LEO, which he did. And then we have a problem with that weapon. We'll do possession of an explosive device. I think that'll be the best one for that. Uh, and those are the charges that he is going to be getting today. Uh, running from us and then all of that. So there you go. We'll find out what happened to him soon. We're going to get a transport unit down here. All right. The prisoner transport is here on scene to take him away. And uh, we're going to be back 10-8. Uh, 911 caller reports a vehicle leaking fuel. Oh, that's not good. Code 3 to that. And of course, it's Grapeseed. Why wouldn't it be anywhere but uh, Grapeseed? We're going to respond to that. Actually, it's right up here in front of us, and they're headed our way, I believe. Is it that one right there? Looks like it's got a lot of damage to it. Yep, it's that vehicle right there. Um, yeah, it's got a lot of damage done to that vehicle, and uh, apparently it's leaking fuel. It's right behind the transport unit. It hasn't been long at all. All right, we're going to stop this dude. Pull it over. What is going on with your car, man? It's unroad worthy to the max. Whoa. All right. He's just, I don't think he's going to stop. I don't think he's going to stop for us here. Could be wrong, but dude, come on. Stop. He's still not stopping. And he is now. It looks like he is going to. All right, there we go. You didn't want to, it looked like. And I tried hitting the B button and all that. It just didn't do anything. So I had to recycle the traffic stop so I could get something done here. All right, so we'll be out with him. Uh, we have somewhat of a plate to read here. So we'll see what's going on with that. Classic 46 Eek 572. Target vehicle license plate. I'm going to see ya. Edward, Edward Jack King Kramer. Target is 10-4. All right, we're going to make contact with him and see what's going on, dude. This car is destroyed. Mr. Kramer, you know what's going on here? Hello, how you doing today? Deputy Fabiano, Blaine County Sheriff's Officer. The stop is obvious. Uh, your car is absolutely destroyed and you're leaking fuel all over the ground. What's all that about? Step out of the vehicle for me. Seems to be nervous and sweating. Bo Bandy. Come over here, Bo Bandy. Come here. Let's grab you. Uh, or not. Wait a sec, buddy. There we go. Come over here, dude. What's going on? Were you in a car accident or something? We got reports of you driving down the road with fuel coming out of the back of this thing. So you have nothing illegal on you, do you? He's going to poke me, stick me, harm me in any way. All right. He's going to... He's, he's just kind of uh, acting nervous and weird. So we're going to double check on that. Metal spoon with burn spots. Uh, broken USB drive. Hochi sock puppet. Uh, placard, okay. Yep, pole position club, gotcha. All right, well, you don't have a gun on you. That's good. Uh, what's going on with the car, man? We don't know. I'm just going to go ahead and search it. Uh, it is getting, because it's getting uh, towed. They get into Tory. Uh, ticket stuff for Caesars Auto Parking, traffic cones, gun fuel, di diesel fuel. Okay, don't care about any of that. We're just going to work with him since he's being cooperative with us. And we're going to get this thing towed out of here uh, today. So let's go ahead and do that. He can just hang out right there for right now. We're going to run his information, make sure he's clear, and then get him on his way with a taxi or something. 
Make it as easy as possible for him. Mr. Jack Kramer. He's had a public intoxication before, parked opposite direction, blah, 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 blah. But he's clear and valid here. We're not worried about it. We're going to we're gonna help him out, you know, since uh, we don't know what happened to the car, but he can't be driving it. He cannot be driving it. All right, man. So we're going we're gonna to help you out here, get you an Uber. And then that will be pretty much that. Uh, your vehicle is going to be impounded uh, because it is not roadworthy. I'm sorry about that, but it just, it's just, it's no good. No good at all. So your Uber's almost here. You have any questions for me? All right. All right, Mr. Kramer, have a nice day. Well, there you have it. The vehicle was destroyed, uh, leaking fuel all over the place. Uh, we went ahead and were nice to him and, and worked with him. We towed the vehicle because it couldn't drive down the road, but he, he gets an Uber and he's going to go home. All right, folks, that's going to do it for this episode of LSPDFR. I'm going to pull in right here. Hopefully you enjoyed the court cases. I got a lot of requests to do that, so I did it for y'all. And uh, that will do it. I'll see you next time. Take care. Hello, everybody. It's Jeff. I uh, just want to let you guys know that uh, merch is available. If you check out the link in the description below, and uh, there should be some images you can click on below the video as well. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. I do appreciate it.